Hello vendors, I wanted to show you guys my vending setup and all the stuff that I use to keep my vending machines safe and how I run them correctly, I think, in my opinion. So let me show you. So I have a vending bag, and inside this bag, I have some wipes for cleaning off machines. I have some food gloves because it makes me look good. I have a bag that has my logo on it. Got this for free. Has my logo on it. Um, and I put my keys inside. inside. It's jammed inside. Right, so I got it open. So I put money in here, obviously. But if I'm not, I have all my keys for my six machines. Um, let me remind you, I'm 11 years old. Six machines. I own. So I keep all my keys in there. And these stuff goes back in. Okay. And then I've got to collect them from more than one place. I have a little pencil pouch. Okay. Rather than that, I have, if I'm collecting more than two locations at a time, I have a collection of a bag. No, it's up here, guys. Uh, here's a collection bag. And then these are for like to hold keys in my mini claw i just have one mini claw okay so let me get that out another egg to hold the key inside i have a couple labels skills and double bubble and a sharpie Oops. another egg some tape just in case and then um some product and then the bottom which is just a bunch of trash i have my phone number printed out um there's another collection bag oh hey a quarter Anyway, so next up, I have a folder, and in this folder, I have little packets that I just got. These that would be a good idea, so let me get those out. Okay, I got those all out. So basically what these packets are is for every time I collect. This one's from my blue triple shop machine. And then here's a second page, two page for each one. Blue triple shop notes and typo there, and two notes. So this page is the same for every machine besides the label at the top. So I'm not gonna show that. But and I also have it for my blue double head. And then my U-turn, which you can see right there that picture and read that um spaced out super many and then that one's not a location that's sitting in my garage i actually got that for free from yow and then i have my black gumball machine so that was a sign here's some handouts to owners so here's for that um that u-turn that i was talking about I basically, this just has some information on it about the machine. 40 inches tall, and a half inches wide. as peanut M&M's, peanut butter M&M's, and Skittles, and gumballs. If we set that aside, then we have a super mini and then that has information for 18 inches because it's a new one from kittymachines.com. It's five and a half feet tall and it has a prize locker. And it takes very little power. And it adds to your business for free. So that's what I put on this. And then I just have a couple more copies and I also have some proof for donations in there. But those have some information on it, so I'm not going to show those. Okay, I'll be right back. Some more things that I have. I'm not going to show them 
anything inside here besides this. But this just has um, purchases. And the reason I'm not going to show it is because it has address and stuff. Um, that's not good. That has an address. Yep, I'm going to stop showing stuff now. Oh, I also have this manual. And it got a little bit dirty. So, and I'm going to show you guys how I make the um those papers right here. So, all right, so here's my laptop. Um this is the how I made the great triple shop one. So basically, I just changed it to say great triple shop. I'm a great no, great triple shop. I made it a year sheet, but if we go back a little bit, one second, like it. Okay, here's um how I made the super mini. So I changed it to super mini. This one's on weekly collection. So one week, two week, three week, four week, one month, um, one month, one month. So this is a three week packet i mean three month packet and then i also have the notes and i just changed the name for everything because everything else is set on a week collection besides that so basically i just changed the name up here and down here and then that's it and then besides that one that i had to change make it a year clip i mean a year clip yeah okay oops that's for real okay but um that's how I run my vending business. I have one more um, thing here. So over here, I basically have some, let's see, so it's just a vending box. And then I have other collect I'm catching the money. So I grab those out. some product here and then I also have empty stuff so that's the last thing and that's how I run my vending business thank you guys for watching um like if you want more vending businesses um vending videos and um subscribe if you want me to start filming me I'm um, filming collect collecting from my locations thank you guys for watching bye